will subscribe. Hello learners, how's it going? Welcome back to Access Belajar with me, Mr. Chance. So, in this video, we are going to learn about several tips to speak English with confidence. Ready? Let's check it out. There are many challenges to learning a new language, but none are perhaps more harmful than our lack of confidence. With love and hesitation hampering our ability to improve, our journey to mastery English can be especially frustrating. But don't worry, learners, here are several learning tips that can help you build your confidence in speaking English. Okay, number one. Listen and repeat. We all have our favorite movie, television show, or even YouTube channel. But instead of just watching them silently, listen carefully to what the character or host are saying and repeat the dialogue that interests you. Go ahead and post. Rewind and listen to the line several times if you must. Or better yet, turn on the English subtitle setting to help you identify each word. This is a fun way of practicing both your listening and speaking skills with the material that are both enjoyable and entertaining. Next, number two, find a friend. It's always difficult to practice by yourself, especially when it comes to improving your speaking skills Therefore, find a like-minded group of friends or classmates who shares your goals of becoming more confident in using English. Get together and implement the English-only rule while you hang out with your friends, meaning that everyone must only speak English for the text, you know, next hour to two. With such a support system, you will feel more secure to open up and speak English without being hampered by insecurities. Number three, read out loud. Whether you prefer a novel or please of notification text, spend at least 30 minutes every day reading and then another 30 minutes reading out loud. This is a great way of developing your reading skills while practicing pronunciations as well as intonation of various words and length of sentence. If you are unsure of how to pronounce a spelled word, simply consult the learner's dictionary, Google or YouTube, but don't get too caught up and details of every single word you don't understand. Well, the point of the exercise is to enhance your confidence in speaking, and reading out loud allows you to practice pronunciation in the privacy and comfort of your own home or room. Okay, the last number four, don't be afraid of making mistakes. Remember, learners, it's okay to make mistakes. If you find yourself stumbling across long or complicated words, simply stop and give yourself a few seconds of break then continue speaking. The fact that you are communicating in a language that is not your mother tongue is reason enough for you to be proud of your accomplishments. As with a very difficult task, the key to speaking English with confidence is to practice, practice and more practice. Be consistent in your language journey and make sure to set aside some time every day to speak English. You know, don't stop uh, study and always practice your speaking because practice makes you perfect. Okay learners, thank you so much to come to our channel. And remember, have to study, ya, karena belajar itu menyenangkan. So, see you next time. Goodbye.
klik tombol subscribe.